Um, I want to talk about 30 days of intermediate fasting. I just did 30 days of intermediate fasting and I wrote the things down on a paper so I can do it really clear and obvious uh, so you can understand me. So why did I do the intermediate fasting? Actually, I'm, I'm getting closer to 40 and healthy is, is very important to me and I want to be healthy. Um, seeing how elderly people become these days, I want to be a healthy older person. And I know that uh, if you're concerned about your health, there are four things you have to take care of. One of them is sleep. One of them is physical activity. One of them is um, a relaxed mind. Uh, so relaxed mind is like uh, meditating or doing other things, maybe praying. And the, the last thing is nutrition. Nutrition is very, very important for your health. So, um, mm, okay. Uh, so why, why actually, who did influence me? Who did influence me? Actually, I saw Dr. Peter Atia since he was talking about the keto diet and other stuff and I was very influenced about what he said and I tried uh, something like a keto diet, not exactly. And then I saw he was talking about intermediate fasting and he, and he showed a video of how he was like um, with a belly and he was training a lot and he still had a belly and, and, I, and I felt the same because um, I was training a lot and I was fat and I was running like eight kilometers three times a week training doing everything and I was still fat because I think the standard diet does not work. What have I tried before? I tried caloric restriction, I tried vegan diet and I tried paleo. About caloric restrictions, restriction, it works. It works great. The problem is you have to put a weight and check what you eat and uh, you tend to eat unhealthy things sometimes because you have like your caloric, caloric limitation and you can eat what you want inside this caloric limitation. Vegan. Vegan for me did not work. It just didn't work. I felt really bad. I couldn't train. I tried to eat like uh, raw vegan. Didn't work. I tried to eat rice. Didn't work. Just couldn't work with a vegan diet. That's me. That's my body. Maybe for you it could work. I'm not a nutritionist. I'm just t telling you about my own experience. Paleo. Paleo did work for me, but I didn't like it that much. So because you have you should restrict your fruits and I didn't like it so um, I'm trying to figure out how to stay um, fit and body and also uh, that my body and my feeling will stay like I was when I was 20 and so that's why I'm doing this stuff uh, how, what kind of um, intermediate fasting did I do I did an eight hour eating window so like maximum I could eat between 12 to 12 in, in the noon till 8 p.m. Usually never happened. I started eating at 12 if I could and I usually stopped eating at 4. Some days I ate till 8 but most days I couldn't eat exactly at 12 because I had other things to do or I could eat exactly at 12 but I couldn't eat after 4 because I was teaching martial arts outside. Uh, so I had one, one day that I, I couldn't, uh, I was very hungry in the morning, I felt weak, I just ate. Because I'm doing it for my health and not to prove nothing to, to somebody, I just want to check if it works. And it works. Uh, what did I discover? The first thing I discovered is very easy from all eating patterns, it's a very easy way to eat. Because you don't eat in the morning and that's really easy. For me, again, that's for me. I lost two kilograms. Um, that happened actually in the first week, but I didn't lose any more uh, weight, two kilograms uh, uh, the first week. I noticed that my belly got smaller and my muscles got bigger. So more than the two kilograms I lost, I guess, with fat, I, I, I guess I lost more than that. And another thing I noticed is that my belly is not swollen. I feel it's empty all the time. And I think it's because my gut is not working that hard to digest food. Most of the time, it's not digesting, you know. It's like empty most of the time. And that's a very, very good feeling. I'm actually now in, in my fasting hours. I'm before 12 um, in the noon. So what is my conclusion? My conclusion is I'm going to continue this pattern. And um, I'm going to tell you about it in my channel. 
and, and it's a, I, I think it's a very good pattern for me but one month is not enough I'm gonna check it more so you, you gotta to get to, to know what I'm doing and what other 30-day challenges I'm gonna do I'm gonna hang on a on a bar to see if I can break two minutes um, maybe I take 30 days of cold showers maybe I do 30 days of meditation I might do many things if you'll stay with me in my channel I'll show you all the things I do so keep in touch watch my videos subscribe press the bell button downstairs down there and um, I'll put links for PTRT lectures and more lectures so you can see for yourself and see what you think about it um, I'm wearing my my training uh, outfit so just finished training thank you very much for watching my video I was very happy to make this video and I hope you subscribe and see more of my videos thank you very much